Hello, hi again, hi everyone, I'm Christian with Crypto Hybrid and I'm bringing you yet another gameplay video. This time I'm playing uh, the prototype build of uh, Tiny Metal. See, it says prototype right there. Now, Tiny Metal is a 3D uh, military themed uh, turn based tactics game where you control, well, a military squad, a faction, a uh, military faction, and you fight other factions. Actually, there are um, uh, three. Uh, let's say combatants in uh, in tiny metal uh, the kingdom of uh, Artemisia uh, The Zipang and the white fangs now the game is uh, as you can see right here It's both on Kickstarter and on Steam Greenlight so on Kickstarter of course is looking to raise funds in order to be finished uh, the developers project milk are um, looking to raise fifty thousand uh, dollars to the campaign which is going to go until October 19th and on Steam Greenlight they're trying to get votes, yes votes, in order to have a Tiny Metal approved for publishing on Steam when the game is finished. Uh, right now the estimate for uh, the release of Tiny Metal is June 2017. So there's quite a bit of way. Uh, now, uh, what can I say? I'm playing the Windows version. Um, there's a stretch goal for Mac and Linux versions. Uh, let's play. Let's play campaign. So it has a story. Of course, the, the, the game will be the base game, right? If it gets funded, it will have a single player campaign, uh, giving you 8 to 10 hours worth of gameplay. And there's a stretch goal that will um, uh, that's set to add one versus one online multiplayer okay so welcome to the tiny metal prototype campaign okay hello this is uh, our Artemisian frontline and this is uh, also our command hq currently Artemisia is engaging combat with ruthless enemy forces we hate to sully our beautiful country with scars of war but in order to protect our country our cities and people we have no choice it's bat it's a battle we cannot lose Please lend me your strength. Please help me. We must finish our develop. Oh, I mean, we need to bring peace to our lands. Oh, me? Who am I? Yeah, my name is Nate Nungrise, uh, one of the commanding officers of the Artemisian Armed Forces. You look really young, dude. You look really young. And it looks like your, your body shape is all wrong. Your, your legs are so thick, and your. Anyway. Uh, one day I want to surpass my commanding officer, Colonel Jula Lingberg, Lingberg the hero of uh, Zel uh, Zelzer. Zelzer, okay. And the purpose of this build is to introduce you to the Tiny Metal game system. You will be able to experience the game flow of Tiny Metal. Actually, I'm just going to be thrown right in the game without a lot of explanation. That's actually what's going to happen in this prototype. Wolfram, Nathan, are you done uh, with your briefing? She's uh, uh, part of the White Fangs, White Fang uh, faction. Sorry for the wait, uh, we're done now, let me introduce you to my friend Wolfram, leader of the White Fangs, a specialized private military contractor. I don't need to be introduced, anyway, uh, I'll see you at the front lines. Okay. Hey Wolfram, but she's supposed to be the heroine of this game, I have no idea what the story will be like. Because the game is still not, yeah. And this guy is also for the White Fangs, he's called uh, Isoroku... Tsumoku, Tsukumo, Tsukumo, okay, yeah, the briefing is taking a long time Nathan, I must warn you this game isn't a script based adventure game, make haste to the front lines, yes we should go and freaking fight because it's already been 3 minutes worth of um, me talking, yeah I got it, I need to explain just a bit more, Tiny Metal is a tactic tactical strategy game, you have to look at the battle map and action modes carefully, sure, it's okay if you understand. You must be uh, you must be the prototype campaign player. Your eyes have a look of a samurai. Really? Cause I'm Caucasian, so I wouldn't really look like a samurai. You know? Anyway, uh, looks like we have uh, we can uh, leave uh, war peace in our in your capable hands. World peace? We're just going to war. Good luck. See you on the front lines. So we're going to fight for peace, obviously. Uh, that was Lord uh, Tsukumo. Uh, in the beginning, he will be an enemy general. Okay, then let's get to the battle map. From here on, it's the actual game. Make sure you keep up with me. Sure, I'll keep up with it. Welcome, I'll take over from here. Okay, so this is the map. Uh, on this banana island, the mission is... First of all, let's capture the city in the southeast. Move your infantry to the city and select the capture command from the action menu. 
It will take the infantry unit two days to capture. Once you have captured the city, you will receive better field of view and be able to see a much larger area of the map. After that, uh, let's see more cities and capture them. And show us uh, what you got. Now, let's lock and load. Okay, so this is... Uh, the game is turn-based, so everybody has a turn. This is my infantry... Uh, unit and I have to uh, and this is the area that I can move this uh, blue uh, space so uh, let's move let's move and then uh, there's an action point I can uh, you know look in some in a direction I'll look here action command hasten ends the turn okay this is my HP command and I have to go and find uh, the building I can capture buildings uh, okay wait let me just go here, let me go here, and of course this is all, uh, you know, discovered. Uh, okay, let me make another, uh, another infantry. This is Fog of War here, so you need to have uh, Battle Day 3, okay. So, uh, okay, let's move with this guy. And we discovered all of this. Uh, let me go here. Why can't I go here? Oh, come on. Okay, that was bad. Alright. Uh, so I just have to move him. And uh, find the building that I have to capture. Which is around here, I believe. Oh, I uh, went into a building. Cool. Um, okay. Uh, explore. Explore the area may trigger an event. Facilities can, on can only be explored once. Okay. I'm going to explore. The explore command will allow you to explore the facility. There is no one here at the moment. But, us but sometimes you gather valuable intel from doing so. Let's find out if it's explorable. Okay, let me make another infantry. Uh, and move him here. As you can see here, I have uh, allies, neutral. Uh, this is uh, the this is the goal. I have zero money, uh, 6,500 points, which I don't know what they do. And this is the turn. Okay. Battle day five. So here with this guy, uh, can I capture? Yeah, capture facility. Okay, I captured the facility. I guess no. Actually, I, I'm I'm capturing right now. I'm still waiting. See, it takes two turns. Okay. Uh, okay, so let me go with this guy here. And as you can see, I, I produce 150 gold per turn. Uh, and that, that, I guess that's depending on uh, how many buildings you have. Okay, I'm going to keep staying here. I'm going to keep capturing the building. Capture a city factory, an airport, or a headquarter. You will take more than one capture. Okay. So I, I'll... Uh, see, I captured this building. Which I guess gives me more... Um, a bigger... Um, I don't know. Uh, area of... Uh, okay. Field of view. Okay, I can make another infantry. I just move it here. I don't need to make any more infantry. I could have fin finished the the game with just um, with just this. Okay, so this is what I have to control. To uh, okay, let me capture the the facility. And as you can see, since I captured this building, I have a bigger cone of. Uh, uh, let me see. Let me go here. Let me capture this building. This guy just stays here. Capture, yes, thank you. And now I can just like go a little bit and explore. There's nothing really here. Alright, uh, I had three more turns. Let me just wait here. Capture. Almost there. Let me capture this one. And I captured this one too. Alright, and uh, that's about it. Uh, explore uh, Welcome young one I think you've heard from Wolfham already that cities provide you with funds every day But they also have another function Okay They also increase your field of view while it's, uh, while it's under your control It is paramount that you have a good situation awareness over your battlefield So it's good to capture buildings 
So capture these hints would allow you to gain real-time tactics information over a large area. Information is more important than the ability to attack. I want you to develop a habit of capturing cities. Okay. Well, I'll just leave him for now. Skip. Uh, as you can see here, uh, since I have more, more than uh, 500 uh, gold, I now I can recruit a bazooka, bazooka unit. Uh, well, infantry, whatever. Infantry unit. Okay. Let me capture it. And captured. Congratulations, you've successfully completed your mission. Here is your last mission. Here's your last mission? What? What does that mean? Okay, so Operation Banana Island. I... Units destroyed? I... Research points. Okay, that, that, that doesn't seem like me doing that. Anyway. Uh, next mission. That was easy. This mission is to destroy all of the enemy units. Okay, alright. Sure, so this is actually a pretty difficult mission. In Banana Island there are no enemy deployed, but in Square Island we're deployed, we've deployed some enemy units, so this is a different island. This time we cannot avoid contact with the enemy. Uh, there aren't a lot of enemy units, but if you don't uh, take this seriously, they will wipe us out. Use terrain wisely to bolster your defenses and try to attack from behind the unit to increase your offensive power. Um, all that done and said, you must increase your vision to protect to detect enemy units early, let's capture a city and scout for enemies. Uh, and show us what you've got. Now let's lock and load! Okay, battle one. I have uh, multiple uh, units right now. I have uh, scout vehicles. Um, okay, and this, these are the enemies moving. I don't have a lot of money. Okay, so this unit... Let me just go... I don't know, here I guess. Let me go here with this unit. Okay. This is another scout vehicle, alright. Uh, let me just go here. Okay, enemies are moving. They're trying to capture things, apparently. Okay, let me look here. Alright, so let me... Oh, I can't capture this one. Alright, so... I'll just go here. Okay, with this unit I can capture this building, so let me go here. Uh, why can't I capture this one? Oh, I, I can only capture that one, I guess. Um, okay, that's odd. Hmm... Okay, let me just go here, and I'll soon see the enemies come out of the woodwork. Uh, this is a tank, so as you can see, the it can attack a big area. Okay, battle day two. Okay, let me skip for now. I'll. Uh, okay, so see, uh, there, there's some units. They're attacking, and they're killing my. Infantry, which is really bad. Oh, see, so there's two of them. Great. Okay. So, can I attack? No, I can't. Well, wait, then I'll go here. And I'll use... Okay, okay you have uh, multiple options here. Attack, uh, which is pretty much just attacking. Lock on. The unit will lock on the target unit and end the turn. You can combine the firepower of other units uh, who have also locked on by selecting concentrated fire. So I'll, I'll do that. I'm going to lock on there. Okay, so I'm, I'm at the building right now. See, they're trying to capture this. Uh, hasten, okay. Okay, let me go here. So, so right now I have. Uh, oh, they can't attack. Merge. The action will allow you to merge with another enemy. Okay, merge. Okay. Now these guys, I'm going to put here, and I'm going to attack this uh, tank unit, this light whatever unit, together with uh, with these. So they uh, both units will fire. Hopefully doing a lot of damage. See? They're both firing. Okay, I'm not sure how much damage I've done, but... Uh, okay, half. I was kind of half. Well, that's pretty good. Okay. 
Now more enemy units. Capture the of course they captured the building because they're so fast, right? Alright, so I have these guys now. Um Let's see. Let me go here. Uh, let's attack. Let's attack these guys in the building. Because I want to capture that building, definitely. I definitely want to capture the building. Oh, come on. They didn't die at all? Great. Battle day one. Okay, I can... Uh, let's make a bazooka unit. And of course, these guys will attack. Oh, my poor, poor units. Okay. My poor units. Alright, well... What can I do except attack, right? Uh, can I attack? No, I'm gonna attack these. Lock on. Um, I'm just going to go here. Hasten. And I'm going to go with these guys here. And hopefully I'll be able to... Ah, capture, finally. Alright, that's good. Uh, I should just stay here for a while, maybe. I don't know what to do. Actually, I'll go here. If there are any units, there'll be units, whatever. Uh, okay, these guys, I can... I can't attack. I don't know why I can't capture this... Uh... Mm, no. Uh, let's see, I can move here. Because this building is crap, apparently. It doesn't give me anything. Okay, let's concentrate fire. Let's both uh, fire. The infantry and the... Uh, I don't know what those are. Light uh, attack vehicles. Okay, done more damage. And we destroyed the one enemy unit, which is good. Now, let's see. Um, well, these are... Hmm. Okay, let me just uh, try to attack these guys. Uh, lock on. Okay, more enemies. As, as you can see, a lot of freaking troops coming. Oh, okay, good. Let's, uh, wait. Wait. Let me attack these guys. Uh, lock on. Attack. Let's attack. Let's see what happens with the tanks. Okay, they're all shooting. I don't know how much damage I've done, but I'll see soon enough. Oh, almost half. Okay, that's good. Okay, so I'm here. Uh, can I attack? Okay, concentrated fire. Now both the infantry units will fire at the people in the building. Hopefully that will do some... Okay. Come on, more freaking enemy units? So many of them, seriously. Okay, so this guy has a bazooka. Right? Let me just go... Um... Hmm. Well, I'll just go here, I guess. Oh, no. Okay. Battle day four. Alright, so uh, we're here. Let's see. Let's try to liberate one of the buildings. Hmm. Can I attack this? Yes. I'll, I'll, actually, I'll try to attack this one. Lock on. Uh, here... Well, I'm okay here, I guess. Hasten. Um, sure, let's make an infantry troop. These guys will fire. I don't know at whom, but... Oh, at the ones outside. Okay. Oh, almost dead. Poor guys. Capture the building, of course. Why not? Uh, sure, I'll capture this building. Hey, I captured the building too, and I don't see a lot of stuff around. That's a problem. Okay, so this is... Mm, okay, these troops. Uh, well... Okay, let me, I don't know, attack, I guess. Let's see what happens. It's just one guy, so it's not going to be great. Alright. Um, very little damage. Alright, so with these guys, I can definitely concentrate fire. Actually, wait. Uh, lock on. I'll lock on too. 
Okay, so there are people coming here. They're attacking these guys with the bazookas, which is bad. Which is really bad. Shit. Okay, that's bad. Uh... Okay, hasten. Oh, come on. Where the hell did they, these guys come from? Oh, come on. See, th th this is something that really, really uh, uh, annoyed me with this uh, prototype. Like, from one mission where you get no enemies, you're en you enter a mission where you have one, two, three, four, a lot of other enemies. So it's like, I'll just throw in the freaking deep end and see how you go. If you want to attract players, you don't, you, you, Offer like a um, well in any case with any game, there should be a difficulty curve. It's not like oh from no enemies you get 20 enemies. Congratulations, learn how the how the game works and try to survive. That's you know it's a little um, uh, it's it's a little problematic. Okay, lock on. Okay, so what do you want me to do if I lock on? Oh, is this okay? Oh, what the hell? Ah, oh, that's bullshit. Merge? Okay, merge. See, there, there, there are more units coming, right? Okay, let me attack these. Assault. This unit will move the defending unit away from the tile. It's occupying. This is a great way to move an enemy unit away from a city tile or escape from being surrounded. Okay, I'll just attack. I'm, I'm attacking them from the side, so maybe I can do quite a bit of damage. I don't know, let's see. Not a lot, actually. That's pretty crappy. Alright, so this, this tank can fire all the way here. So let me attack these guys. Why are they shooting down? Oh, I didn't... I didn't fire at these people. Why did I... What? That's... Uh, that's freaking odd. It's... It's... It's odd. It is odd. Actually, let me... Lock on. Okay, so. Okay, that's an enemy troop. Uh, sure, let's make an infantry. It, it, it's, it's really annoying because it's... Uh, the game doesn't teach you... The, I, I know it's a prototype, but it's like a prototype made by people who've been playing... Um, Tiny metal for a long time, and it's like, yeah, sure. Let's uh, okay. Let me just go here. Let me stay here for now. Okay. Let's attack. It, it, it's it's a little bit uh, f it's actually it's quite frustrating because this prototype should be you know a showcase of how the game can be like but not not in the sense that not not in such a way that you get frustrated by playing because the game doesn't tell you anything it throws you in the deep end like yeah sure learn to swim throw you in the water eh, just come on let, let's try some exercises no this is from i mean look how many units one two three four five at least five units at least and that's you know just it's a learning, it's a learning experience. Like, l let's learn together how to play Tiny Metal. No, just go. Just start war. No, no training, you know, that, that, that's, that's the problem. Okay, so this one, let's see, let's try to... Uh, okay, let me try to attack. Concentrated fire, now we should fire with both. Oh, there's one, one only one... Uh, Unit here. Wow. Okay, we we destroy that. Uh, oh, and another one is coming. Of course, another one is coming. You know, th th this is this is the annoying part, right? It's it's really frustrating, and that's why I'm not going to finish this mission probably because because the freaking game. Look how many. You look how many. Now these are tanks. Uh, the, of course, these are tanks. So the enemy has produces uh, produces units, I guess, right? They produce units. They um, okay, wait, let me just see, okay, attack, come on, maybe you can kill them, maybe, maybe, come on, and it's, you know, more, more units coming, they're attacking, it's like, yeah, sure, just ease the player into tiny metal, ease him into the, into the game, oh, of course, they were attacked and killed, great, that, that's, that's awesome. 
That is awesome. When I say that's awesome, no, that's shit. That is shit. Oh, well, attack. Just two guys, it's... Uh, that's a big problem. I mean, especially since since you have a game that's on green light and on Kickstarter, if you want to attract players and say, oh, let, let's just get, uh, you know, maybe you'd like uh, to consider, you know, um, uh, funding the game, then make it attractive. And by making a prototype that's so unfriendly towards new players, then that's not attractive. You know, that, that's just. Pe pissing people off, annoying them, of course, a new unit, see? So more and more and more and more units. This is the first mission, this is the first mission, right? Um, so it, it's it's really frustrating to see something like this. Um, uh, a build, a prototype, like a, any game being showcased like this, any game, because it's not a... From what I'm seeing, it's not a bad game, it's a... Okay, it's a tactical game, it looks cute, It's it has some uh, tactical depth. That's that's perfectly fine, you know. But um, but the way things are, you know, are are showcased, then yeah, all right, this is whatever. Like, I'd rather play something that's that doesn't um, um, abandon me in the middle of the battlefield. It's you know. All right, let's see now. Uh... Okay, let's attack. Oh, of, of course, and there are more troops in the in the bushes. In the that, that's you know, that's that is annoying. I gotta say that is annoying. All right, so now why the hell did you move? Seriously, that's so annoying. Come on, so few people, few people died here. Okay, I need to. I really want to capture the building. I'm just going to attack with everything I have. I really want to capture the building because it's um... make some freaking progress. I mean, you know. Okay, let me go here. Uh, capture facility. Okay, let's make another infantry. Capture the building. Great. These guys are firing from where exactly? From where are they attacking? I don't even know. Oh, they just appeared over here. Okay, that's good. That's so good to know. That's so good. Oh, so I couldn't capture this building with someone else, but they can capture it. So that's that's great. At least that's okay. Attack. Oh, the, and they captured another building there. So so first mission, your enemy already has an advantage in terms of probably numbers of troops and the bases they have close to them. But yeah, yeah, that's that that makes freaking sense. Um Okay, attack. Oh, and the tanks are here too. Uh really annoying, really pissing me off. Really pissing me off the way the way it's presented, the way it's presented. It's like, yeah, sure, let's just Learn the games uh, in your first playthrough. Why not? Because it's you know I, I was thinking I, I played the game yesterday, and um, and I was you know thinking about uh, you know making a game preview, and then I saw like oh great, uh, but I invested like forty minutes worth, and I haven't finished this. I, I played this mission twice. And I got so frustrated, frustrated and I haven't finished yet, I just like quit. And then, you know, I... Um, but I thought, you know what, no, this this should be something that's that's uh, played. Um, okay, let's see, so... Okay, new troops, see, new troops. New troops. Uh, okay, so I made another... Troop here, Kasten, I guess. See, and the tanks are. It's 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 really really frustrating. I I gotta say, it's. I don't know why. I don't know why they did this. I really don't know why they did this. Why um, the developers did this? It's like. Okay, so let me try to. Uh, let's assault. Let's see what happens with the assault. Oh, they're not dead yet. Alright. Wow, that is bullcrap. 
Okay, let me keep uh, capturing the facility. Skip. These guys, where did these guys come from? I don't even know where they come came from. It's like you can't see the the movement or oh they got out. You can't you can't really properly see the movement of the character of the of the enemy troops. It's a little yeah. Well, of course that can be fixed. It's just you know all the you know more troops, more freaking troops. You know more stuff, more. And this is the first freaking mission, the first mission that you actually have combat in. First one. And look how 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 um, how convoluted it is, you know, and full of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's that's freaking a lot. That's freaking a lot of enemies. Okay, infantry. Okay, infantry. Okay, let me attack these guys from behind. Maybe I can actually kill them if I attack them from behind. That should be a tactical advantage or whatever. No. Nothing, okay, that's great. That's crap. Uh, okay. okay, you die. Assault, attack. Let's attack. Yeah. Oh, come on. Shit. Uh, okay. Now, uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Well, I guess I can attack these guys. That tight yeah. Are they dead? Are, are you kidding me? They were They're invincible. They are invincible. These guys are invincible. Okay, let me capture no capture the building. Uh capture facility. Okay, these guys I don't know. Let me Go here and attack these guys from behind. Maybe I can do something. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I can actually do some freaking damage with these guys. No, still not. They're invincible. I, I attack them from the side and from the back and they're freaking invincible. Um, yeah. Okay, let me continue. What, what unit is this? Okay. Okay, let me go here. Attack. Oh, this guy is just one lonely, lonely soldier. Well, at least he killed one person. Uh, all right, they're attacking. Uh, this and this, this closing in on the things you can't. It's like, oh my god. It, um, it's it's a little distracting when all it's okay. Are they killed? Are they attended? Alright, so these guys are still not dead. Let's assault them. Let's see what happens if we assault them. Okay, they're still not dead yet. And they're still... Okay, so we moved in the... Okay, okay, to the building. That's good. Now, let me attack these guys. Actually, let's assault them. I don't know. Let's try that. Maybe we can push them back. Push them further back and I can move forward in the bushes. Okay, so that happens. See, more troops, more troops, more troops. This is the first mission, more troops, M more enemies. That's really, that's really crap, I gotta say. It's really crap and it's really frustrating. And I think it's a disservice to, to Tiny Metal to showcase the game like this, uh, in, in, in this way. Okay, attack. Because, it, so it's been like what? 30 minutes or almost 30 minutes worth of, of, of play the first mission should not take like when you're learning it when you're showcasing it when you're uh, we're teaching the player game you know how to play something you don't take that long it shouldn't take that long it should be like um you know okay did I capture this building no I haven't yet okay it's still not captured okay uh, okay let's get a bazooka guy in here you don't really um, the well, it's a prototype, so let's... Oh, sorry, I hit my microphone by mistake, I apologize for that. See, more troops coming out of the woodwork, whatever. Um, it's really frustrating. Okay, assault, let's assault them. See, more troops over there, troops over here. They keep keep making, keep making, so the, the, the enemy keeps making. I have a limited amount of, you know, resources myself. 
Um, I still, I still in capture the facility, which is crap. Come on, attack! Oh, more there! Great, that that's so good. Oh, and these guys are invincible! They are invincible! Of course, there's probably a game mechanic that makes them, you know, take less damage, but nobody told me anything about that because, yeah. Oh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh, assault, let's assault them. Let's assault them with one guy, let's see if he can push them back. Are they going to go back? No, they're not going to go back. Okay, so that guy went to capture the building, which apparently I couldn't beforehand? I don't know, it's it's really odd. Uh, yeah, that's... Um, problematic, I'm going to call this... this Prototype problematic. Um, yeah. So over here you can see like one, two, three, four, five, and they're like six. So so many seven I think here. So a lot of enemy troops in the first mission. So I'm going to finish the game here because this is going to take an hour or something, and this is just supposed to be like a kind of a uh, more compact uh, showcase uh, gameplay view. Gameplay view. You, you, I think you know it's the the gameplay is pretty straightforward. You move them. You uh, place yourself in positions of uh, w where you can get some advantages. Uh, you capture buildings, which I guess give you money. I guess which buildings? How? Which buildings give you what? I don't know, but sure. Uh, it's still a prototype, I understand that, but um, the difficulty of this first combat mission, I think it's uh, it's too much. And it shouldn't be like that, it shouldn't be like this for a, for a prototype that has three missions. So it has three missions, this is the second one, it's the first one with actual fighting. Uh, it's, just, it's just frustrating and unfair, I think, for any player who comes in, if, even if they're really... Uh, I mean, it should be available for everyone it's not uh, and that's that's a problem but you know what uh, you can check out the tiny metal on green light and on Kickstarter there are links in the description below if you want to vote it to see it on Steam uh, then uh, go there and vote yes and if you uh, want to see the game finish then uh, and, and want to help the developers uh, project milk uh, then go to the Kickstarter page and pledge um, a little bit of money like uh, I don't know how much is uh, uh, the game uh, but uh, go there and uh, pledge because they need to raise fifty thousand dollars until October nineteenth. Uh, so everyone, this has been Tiny Metal. I I like I'm liking the graphics. The idea is cute. The execution of this prototype is I think detrimental to you know getting uh, good uh, good feedback from uh, from players. Uh, so yeah, this has been uh, Tiny Metal, thanks everyone for watching, if you like this video or any other content that I put on the channel, like for example other gameplay videos or developer into his live streams, uh, walkthroughs even, then please click on the subscribe button, subscribe to Cryptic Hive for more, and tell your friends because sharing is caring, and it will help me immensely and it will allow me to continue doing this, to continue showcasing you new games like Tiny Metal. Uh, thanks everyone for watching, uh, again, uh, Cryptic Hybrid, subscribe uh, for more, until the next time we see each other, have an awesome day!